Hey everyone, welcome back to Wildflowers. So, you can pause your game, which is pretty cool. Um, we just got up the next day and collect. Um, yeah, we want to get these beans going for Thomas. Since we can't find another weed to make another. Well, I wish I hadn't put the compost thing right there. I was not sure what it was or now I kind of watched a little bit of my ep first episode and I had seen a weed right there <laughs> so we're gonna see if we can make another flower bed I wish it would let us move this seriously okay so let's make a garden bed oh it says we don't have any soil Oh, it has to make soil? 23 hours and 40 minutes. Wow. Okay. Well, we won't be able to do that yet. Three days remaining. And four days remaining. Okay. All right. Well, the gardening will take a little time then, huh? Okay. Okay. So what do we need to do from spud to spud? We've got take the potatoes to grandma. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I can't thank you enough for helping out here, sweetheart. Are the potatoes ready to harvest? Yes, yes they are. Grandma, here's four potatoes from the field. Ooh, wonderful. Maybe you've got a greener thumb than you thought. Why don't you take them down to the general store and sell them? I'm sure Lena will give us a fair price for them. Okay. We will do that. So, I like how the characters have the voice actors and that they talk and you don't have to worry about that. That's pretty cool. It gets kind of tiring um, reading them yourself if they don't have voice actors. So that's definitely a plus. And nobody wants to hear my voice all the time. <laughs> okay, so the store is over. No. The store is over here. Okay, so I want to sell... Switch to the sell page to see what items you can sell at the shop. Oh, wow. Okay. Nice. These items are now available for purchase. Let's go shopping. So, um, I wonder if we want to go get more green bean seeds. Um, I kind of want to see... Tell grandma you, s okay. Build garden beds. Yeah, that's just really hard. You know what this show hint is? You'll need fertile soil from the compost bin. Yeah, we already know that. This may take a while. Um, Catch a squid for the, f oh, that's right. Bruno asks you to practice fishing by catching any fish. I got to catch one more. Where have you been? Oh, we have to get four more and we'll be able to do that. So I'm not going to buy anything yet. Okay. Let's go down the ocean and let's see if we can do some more fishing. It looks like you have to go way over to the ocean side and you can't fish there. Kitty! I wonder if we get the heart up all the way if we get to keep him. That would be cool. I only have one more bait. Look at look, look the little crab. Mackerel. Okay, but we have to catch a... We have to catch a squid, right? 
for the Farseer, so I'm kind of looking at shadows maybe a little bit. And I think later we're going to need these palm fronds, if I remember in the demo. The demo didn't go very far, but I remember a few things just really... I don't have any bait. Maybe oh. I should visit Bruno's shop? Okay. Where's Bruno's shop? Oh, is it the shop that's kind of like in the square? I think so. So maybe that's what we need to buy is um, with our money that we just made is some um, bait. <coughs> and I don't know if we should be picking up the shelves. Maybe we should. Um. Wonderful. You got the look of a lifelong angler in your eyes now. <laughs> oh, now here's a real challenge. Uh oh. Catching a certain fish is about the right bait, the right place, and luck. I got a hankering for some nice, fresh striped sea bass. They're ocean fish, so you gotta go to the beach. They might go for a worm, but you'll have better luck with this. In the future, you can keep bait fish you catch to try and hook bigger and more valuable fish. Come back when you caught one. Okay. <clears throat> What's this? Recipes for fish fans. Hmm. We have seventy eight dollars. Okay. We'll just catch that for now. Um oh, could I sell fish? Okay, because I've caught a dab and three sardines. Oh, a mackerel and a chub. Well, now we have $99. That's pretty cool. Okay. So, yeah. But the farseer needs a squid. Right? So, we gotta catch a squid. Seems like you have to go really far over to catch any fish though, doesn't it? When there's all this ocean right here. Just saying. Okay, but we still need a squid. <laughs> None of these look like squids. Another dab. But I need a squid. a squid. Now the squid was in the ocean, right? It was in the ocean that I thought, because I thought he said we had to go to the beach to get the squid. And squids are in ocean. They're not in the lake. Right? 
Okay, Bruno's closed up shop. I wonder if he's at the bar that I passed already. <clears throat> no, I'm not seeing Bruno anywhere. Him. I wonder where Bruno lives. I don't think that matters because I don't think they'll let us go in there anyway. I just think I saw him coming from this way that first time we met him. Is why I'm wondering. I wonder if squids come out at a certain time of day. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh. We want that squid right there. Well, fishing is really easy, you guys. It's a squid. Yay! Um, fishing is really easy, so that's a plus. And I like that you don't have to change your tools. It just does that for you. Depending on what you're trying to do, it just does it for you. So that's pretty cool. Okay, Bruno, where are you? There you are. Oh, would you look at that beauty. What would you like for your prize? I would like a shower. <laughs> uh, smelling like gut bait is part of the line. You'll get used to it. Speaking of bait, here's some more. I've given you three different kinds of bait. Give them all a try. They'll catch different fish in different water. Happy angling. Okay. Fish too can now be crafted in your kitchen. Cool. Okay, so now we need to go talk to the fire seer. Is it fire seer? And give him the squid before it gets too late and we get stuck across town. She does a lot of running, doesn't she? I wonder if there's um, a time when you can change your outfit or anything like that. I mean, I feel kind of bad that she's always in a dress. Looks like you can only raise the hearts once a day. Farseer, <clears throat> excuse me, says to build a desk in your sanctum. They sure do have a lot of requests. <laughs> that's for sure. New blue, oh, that's a cool looking desk. Desk can now be constructed in your basement. Guys, that is cool. Okay, so let's go do that. If we have time before we have to go to bed. Again, the time seems to go really fast to me. That can be a good or a bad thing, depending. Um, well, so far, this is pretty cool. Now, I will say I am past the point that I was in the demo. Um, so this is all new, even though I didn't really remember the demo a whole lot. 
I, it, it was familiar. There was familiar things, but yeah, that was like in June, so. <laughs> and you didn't really get to play the demo, didn't really last that long, so. Um, oh, and my sanctum. I was like, where's my sanctum? Okay. Okay. What do I need for a desk? I need 10 planks. I guess those are planks. It doesn't really say. Um, oh, we can make a distillery. Holy cow. Mortar and pestle. Cool. Okay. Well, we, we might have time to go out and get a little wood. Um, if we can find it all like right here. Oh my gosh. All right. I, I do wish that it was a, a thing that you could just walk over and it picks it up for you. But it's not like horrible. <clears throat> Looks like the wood comes back pretty readily. I'm all out of strength. I could eat some food to recover. Oh, okay. I forgot about food. Um, like, where's my food? Um, that must not be my inventory, right? Ah. Okay. I just want enough to get a little bit more wood. Oh, I see your energy bar is up by the clock. Okay. Okay. We're just going to have to go to bed. And then we'll get, we'll do the rest of it tomorrow. We may have enough wood anyway. I'm sleepy. Yes, I am. <laughs> I've been so excited to play this today. Work took forever all day today. Like, oh my gosh, I'm so excited to come home and get the game. <clears throat> Tomorrow will be the same way. Lean about the potatoes, just as you said. Well, here's the money, Grandma. I won't hear of it. You did all the work. You deserve the reward. But Grandma, I... I mean it. If you want to keep fixing things up around here, you'll need all the cash you can get anyway. Buy some more seeds. If we keep the fields planted... You always have a way to make ends meet. Oh, okay. But only because I'm going to use the earnings to help the farm. Yay! Okay. Oh. Look, I forgot where I was going. So, desk. Okay. Where do we want to put the desk? Oh, it says you can rotate it. Oh, that's like zooming. That's as far out. Oh, we're, there we go. Well, it won't go up against the wall. I don't like that. Um, I'm just going to put it right there. Okay. Tell Fraser you built the desk. we got to go take care of our plants. Um, eek. Oh, <gasps> the kitty. Oh, hey there, kitty. Do you belong to my grandma? Oh, well, you're a good kitty. Grandma, you didn't tell me you have a cat. A cat? <laughs> Last cat I had was old Shadow. Rest his soul. He wasn't Shadow. He was a darn good That's my doggie's this name. Is it yours? She seems awfully familiar with your garden. Oh, no. I don't own that cat. What a notion. She's a good friend to have around, though. So play nice. <clears throat> okay.
Yay! And we need more wheat. Grr. Oh, you need more wood. Okay. But then we'll at least be able to build one. So, yay! Oh, come here, kitty. Okay, we want to keep her heart going up because I want that kitty. Okay. Um, oh, well, there's weeds. This is where I was going to come over and look to see if there was more weeds. And there is. So, yay. It was an uneven amount, though, so I'm not all excited about that. But, hey. Okay, let's go see if we have enough to make another flower bed. And we've got enough weeds that we can go ahead and start the next batch of soil. Again, I wish I would have moved this. <clears throat> I'm going to kind of put it over as far as I can. And I, I wish we could move the other ones. <gasps> we can awesome now we can move that yes oh it has to be on here oh bummer okay well then let's just move it right here so it's just kind of even with everything don't pack the soil too tight now you'll choke the seedlings oh hello, thomas hello thomas i didn't hear you that's because I don't wear big clumpy boots like you city folk. Anyway, I like him. Not a bad effort for your first plot. Wow, you give compliments? Don't make me regret bringing these for you. <laughs> Carrot seeds! Thank you. But what's the occasion? Hazel's <clears throat> a good woman. Strong. But you don't need me to tell you she's struggling. So when I saw you out helping with the garden beds, well, She's not the only one who appreciates it. I'll do my best with these seeds. Nice. So yeah, we want to, um, it's hard to tell if they've been watered. I mean, I guess, I guess it's a little dark. Two days remaining. Okay. All right. Well, I guess that's all we can do until we get more soil. And then we can make another garden bed. Oh, I we need to tell Fraser you built the deck. We need to do that. <clears throat> okay, I feel like I'm kind of starting to get the hang of it a little bit more. I'm, I'm just afraid I'm going to miss something. Um... I saw a little bit of a clip of a video of somebody giving some tips and one thing they said is to pick up everything you possibly can because there aren't really seasons and they said something weird like they only come around once which makes no sense to me. Are we saying there's not a second year? I mean I don't I don't know. Um, not sure so I'm just gonna pick up what I can. I guess nobody just walked. Oh. Huh. This is the moonflower bush. But I guess I can't pick the flowers until tonight. Oh, right. Okay. I wasn't sure what those were. They didn't kind of look like them. Nobody's over here. Him. Okay, well, I guess we'll have to wait till tonight. 
I guess maybe they're only going to be out there in the evening. So, I guess we're going to be huffing it back and forth. Which I mean, I guess is fine, but <laughs> kind of fun. Okay, what else do we have to do? Um, build bins. We're, we're working on that. We're working on that. Um, oh, it kind of tells you the hearts. So the cat is up to kind of uh, almost a half a heart there, I guess. Cooking. Oh, it kind of tells you the different... Oh, okay. Okay, kind of like a little pedia. So that's kind of cool. I kind of want to go over to the farm area again and um, get some more wood. So we can kind of be ready with that. Um... Yeah, because it's only 2.30. Oh, look. Look at the little mouse. Oh, I see you found the bug. <clears throat> this is it? I went looking for it, but I, I wasn't sure. Remember the time I milked Bessie and she kicked over the milk bucket? I hid in the barn because I thought you would be mad. <laughs> no use crying over spilled milk. Or a barn that got thrown down in a storm, I suppose. I had to give up keeping cattle. So does that mean this is... Yeah, the chicken coop. After Merlin passed, I didn't have a dog to guard the chickens, and they kept getting picked off. I chopped up the coop for firewood. Oh, that's a shame. Do you think we could restore them? I'm sure we could. But after that old ranch closed up, the nearest place to get more animals is miles away. If Mayor Otto would bestir himself to do something about that, then... Fixing up these buildings would be light work for Parker. Okay. So I'm hoping that eventually we will be able to restore the barn of the coop. <clears throat> so that would be pretty cool, huh? Um, okay, so we want to, why do I keep going on the wrong thing? No. That's what I mean to go into. I got apple pie. How did I get apple pie? can't really see what's over there. <clears throat> okay, so let's go see what else we can make. Like, what else can we make over here? Candle maker, fermentation barrel, juice press. Okay. Oh, it looks like you need to get uh, iron bars for those. Yep, that too. Okay. Um, what about downstairs in this sanctum? What else can we make down? What else can we make down here? Distillery. You need a copper bar. Mortar and pestle. Yeah, you need iron bars. So we need to go to the mine. How do we get in the mine? Get the mine restored. 
Okay, in a minute we're going to have to go over there and give <clears throat> the stuff to the fairs here. Um, a little more mushrooms. It's a collapsed mine shaft. <laughs> Looks like I can't get into it until it's fixed. I know, but I want to know how to fix it. <laughs> I guess we don't get to learn that yet. Patience. Patience is a virtue. Okay, let's head over to the other side of town again. <clears throat> I really, really, really love the graphics. Um, very, very much. Gameplay is very, very good. Birdies. And I just wonder if this is the type of game because you can raise friendship levels if you need to do that to unlock certain things. I mean, I'm not sure. Do, 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 do. Let's get our moonflowers. I'm just afraid I'm going to screw up something because I'm not going to end up doing something that I probably should do, but don't know to do, or how often to do it, or... Initiation right cannot be crafted at your writing desk. Okay. Um, should we put in another? Let's put in. Uh, I I don't know. I don't know what that means, but they told me to do it as often as you can, so I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> I feel like by the time I come over in this section at night, though, that I don't have all, any time to do anything when I get back to the farm because it's like time to go to bed because it just feels like it's that far away. Like, it's been an hour and 20 minutes already just going across town back and forth. Hmm. Hmm. I don't mind time moving a little fast. I don't like it to move too fast. But I don't feel like I can get everything done that I need to get done or want to get done. <clears throat> okay. Okay. So, oh, we need the bottle of ink. Okay. Okay. This incantation is required for a new member to join the coven. Okay. All right, we did it. Tell the farseer you created it. Okay, we'll have to do that tomorrow. Because I, I mean, we can try it. I don't know if we can make it all the way over there and back in time. Let's try it, though. Oh, yeah, that's the only bad thing so far that I'm not real fond of is how far everything is. 
But that may change with the story. So I'm not too hyped about it, you know. I'm not going to make a big hype about it because it probably will change with the story. This is probably just because it's the beginning. And there's certain things that you always have to do the beginning of, the, of most games. So I'm just going to be patient and run a lot in the hills. Which seems kind of odd. But anyway. You think Grandma would have given her some overalls or something. Some shorts. Who am I supposed to give this to? Um. Oh, tell the farce here. Okay. Shh. See? Okay. What kind of a witch will you be? A good witch? There are no good witches or bad witches. Only good or bad actions. Oh, I thought that was the high priestess. No? Must be this one. Yep. Have you the incantation for the initiation, right? Yes, it's ready. Good. Initiate Tara, give the incantation to Elder Hazel. She must be the one to cast it. Here's the initiation incantation, Grandma. Honeybee, before we get started, I have a gift for you. This has been in our family for generations, and it is our custom to pass it on at the time of initiation. Go ahead, try them on. Oh, purple, my favorite color. For you, they fit you beautifully. I feel taller. <laughs> that was done during my Aunt Vivian's time. She was a bit on the short side and wanted to appear more regal. So she spelled the rose. Then the other witches got jealous, and we might be magical, but we're still human. Elder Hazel, initiate Tara. Take your places for the right. Initiate. You seek new knowledge, but with it comes a secret duty. Who brings forth this initiate to join our coven? I do. As the great wheel turns, so must we take our part. Here where our ancestors stood before us, and where others will follow. Enter our circle, for this is the hour. A fair haven witch comes into her power. you have been rewarded with whatever those are these items can now be crafted at your writing desk okay uh, we gotta go to bed probably never gonna make it in time it's kind of like stardew volley all over again where you're coming out of the mines and you're trying to make it home to your bed in time most of the time, I would not make it in time, and I'd lose money and <laughs> all kinds of stuff. Look how fast she got here. What the heck? You go, Hazel. I'm trying to get there. I'm trying to get there. I'm trying to get there. Yeah, that is a long way to go, you guys. I'm just saying. <laughs> it's getting late. Yeah, I know. I am trying really hard to get there before the 2 o'clock hour. I don't know if I'm going to make it. See? What did I tell you? 
It's just like Stardew all over again. <laughs> oh, I don't feel so good. Yeah, way to go. Good, you're finally awake. Mm. Amira, you pushed yourself too hard and developed a fever. Then you passed out. I was having oof, amazing hallucinations. Sorry, Tara, but it's back to the real world for you. Now, it may take a few days for you to go back to feeling normal. And don't let me catch you treating yourself poorly again, or we will have words. Mm, okay. You're scary with words. Won't do that. I'm already feeling better, though. Whatever Amira puts in her medicine, it's amazing. Okay, so... And it's 11.30 a.m., you guys. So you lose... Ugh. You get sick and you lose a lot of time. Wow. Okay. But then how do you get over here faster? Now, one thing it said that you could write on your desk, it looked like maybe it was like, I'm going to talk to her. Hello again. Hi. You know, you don't see many blacksmiths these days. Yeah, I know. Well, my great-grandpa was a blacksmith, so I guess you could say it runs in the family. Of course, he died before I was born, but it's his hammer I've got. That's really cool. So your family taught you? Oh, nah, I'm self-taught. A city export like yourself. It's harder work than sitting at a desk, but it's more rewarding. You'll come to love it here. We'll see. Oh, you can buy ingots? Oh. They can be sold to Natalia or used to upgrade tools. Oh. Oh. This is where you can get upgraded tools or a shovel, but you need 20 ingots for that. Dang. Huh. Yeah. Definitely got to get to the mine. Get the mine fixed. Okay. Let's go check on our plants. I see a mushroom. Oh, I see a mushroom. Uh-huh. I see mushrooms everywhere. Need more wheat. Story of my life. Need more wheat. I've got wood. I've got soil. Why can't I build? Do I not have enough money? How do I know how much money I have? Um, nothing tells me. to my storage though, don't I? What's that? Um. Oh, I have $24. Okay. Sounds like we need to go sell some stuff. Let's go see what we can sell. Okay, um, let's see, um, you could also sell, I don't know what all, the, what all this stuff is. Where'd I get all this stuff? I kind of don't want to sell all the food though, you know? Uh, black tea, cabbage, milk, egg. Where did I get cheese and stuff? Hmm. 
Let's sell coconuts. It feels like we can get more of those. Okay. Let's go back and see if we can make that um, that bed. It's such a quaint little town, though, isn't it, you guys? I really, really like the town. And I can't wait to, like, be able to upgrade the farm and all that kind of stuff, you know? Okay, that's what it was. So, I wonder if we need to leave, like, one little section to walk through. Can we walk through that? Yeah. Oh, we'll plant carrots. Okay. Need to see if we can find some more weeds so we can make another garden bed. <clears throat> There's one thing I like is to be able to get everything crafted so that we can do what we need to do. Um, we also need to go down and see what those other th things are. Like, I wonder how often the weeds sprout back up over here. Cause I, oh, there's one right there. Because I think I had one extra. <coughs> Yep, I did. Cool. Okay, because I kind of want to see. Speed boost. Crafting this incantation requires magic. This bar shows your current magic level and how much you will how much will be used. You can replenish your magic at the wellspring. Oh. So, yeah, we need more of the pink flowers uh, and the ink. We'd have to catch another squid. Gotcha. Seven small things? Okay. So, obviously, we need squid and we need, um, gotcha. I kind of wanted to go over to this area over here to fish and see what kind of fish we can find here. Yeah, really to fish. As soon as it grabs the line, you just hit your X button and it pulls it up. A ray thin fish found near the farm. Common. Sell it to Bruno or cook with it. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Just kind of trying out the different areas. <clears throat> I mean, I don't want to go... <clears throat> excuse me. I don't want to go way over to the other area like... Oh, I see wheat. Um, like every single night. You know what I'm saying? Um, we definitely want to get the weeds when we can. Because obviously we need a bunch of those. I'm going to keep getting these flowers because I don't know what all they're going to be used for. But And I guess we can make some more mushroom soup. I think we need eggs though or milk. It was either eggs or milk. Um, okay. I thought over here was that pink flower. Um, uh, maybe it's somewhere else. No, I don't remember. <laughs> because that pink flower was needed, um, for the speed boost. Guys, this is really cool. I'm really, really enjoying myself. <clears throat> I just love stuff that has quests games that have quests. Ooh, what's this up here? I do remember somebody had a tip when you can when these are ripe and you can gather them, you want to do that. So, let's keep making sure we come up here and see when they bloom so we can make sure we do that. I just want to catch get the shells because I'm thinking 
they might be worth some money, right? So we definitely want to keep making money. So this is kind of like a little beach on its own, it looks like. Oh, look how pretty. Yeah, it's weird how the camera control, there's only just a certain slightness to it. Um, I mean, it's better than nothing. Because, um, like, Coco Life does, it has no camera control at all. Like, you can't, you can't do this. Oh, there's that pink flower. I think, I guess things can just grow anywhere, you guys. So we just need to keep looking around. Oh, you can go all the way around here. Okay. Yeah, you got to explore. Got to explore. Okay. Okay, what all do we need to do? Where have you been? <laughs> I just now saw that. We need one more garden plot. So, uh, I'm not staying up real late because I don't want to go through that again. Um, we don't have any business over there at this time. So, I'm not going all the way over there. Although, my kitty's probably over there. But, hopefully, the kitty will come back over this way. And since we have a little bit of energy left, um, <clears throat> just thinking maybe we could get a little bit more wood. I'm sure we're always going to need a lot of it. See? I'm going to bed when it tells me to. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yes, ma'am, sir. I am going. Like right now, before I get yelled at. And we're not going through that again. No. Is it time for bed? Yes, I know. Can you believe it? Anyway, you guys, thank you so much for joining me on this episode. What are you thinking? Do you like wildflowers? Are you, are you, did you get it on Switch or on Steam? Or are you thinking about it? Um, I, I seriously am having a great time. And... Um, I'm really, really liking the game. So, I really thought I would, though, when I played the demo way back when. That's why I've been so excited for it to come out. So, let me know what you think in the comments. And uh, if you're enjoying the playthrough, like, give my video a like. And that tells me how much you're liking it. Um, and I appreciate it. So, until next time, I'll see you soon.